obviously when you're out on open roads, giving it some nice exhaust notes, dump valves, you can't beat it. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a push. Push, let me try bump it. It's a big city. It's like one of the biggest in the country. That no one's ever heard of it. Imagine somewhere that 200 years ago was really prosperous and rich. And then that is totally gone now. With Bradford, you, you've got to have a nice car. It's as simple as that. Or you, you love people that be driving around in like, you know, 80 gun Range Rovers but living in a 60,000 pound house. I think Bradford is known to be the city of cars. In Bradford, we've got like quite a big car community. It gets you out, meet people, you're out and about and doing all sorts, and you get to know everybody. People from different faiths, cultures, so you just gather up, just talk. You know, it's not just uh, having a nice car or, you know, putting a lot of time into it. It also brings people together that you wouldn't normally be friends with. I've always been doing it as a hobby at home, just working on my own cars now, just decided to start doing it as my job. I'm, I'm Muslim, I'm Pakistani, because it's, it's quite a male-dominated industry, he weren't for it. But this year, because I've been working on his car, and because I've showed him, you know, Dad, you don't need to replace your headlights, your, your rusty fenders, I can do them all for you, he's more for it. The strange thing is, in life, everybody has a passion for something. You know, some have passion for cars, some have passion for bikes, Whatever it is, whatever you have a passion, it's something that keeps you going in life. It means freedom. I can go, I can go wherever I want, and do whatever I want. I've been in a wheelchair for five years now, and uh, with this car, I've, be, I've met new people as well, going to these car meets. I've got a collection of cars at home. We just have them all parked up, wake up in the morning. When I look at them, it just it puts a smile on my face. You know, sometimes you need to get away from everything. You know, if your head's a bit battered or been arguing with your missus, just go out, have a drive, go down country lanes, whatever. Just let it rip. <laughs> Legal, obviously. <laughs> Yo. You know, a car expresses someone's personality the way they are. It's a bit of a statement for themselves, you know what I mean? When it comes to cars, nothing matters. Nothing matters. You, you're all in one place and you, and you share the same passion. So it's just you, your car, and your radio. That's all it is. It's an extension of yourself. 